What is up, beautiful people of YouTube? My name is Jerry Tessic, and welcome to episode number four of Tropical Six Sandbox Gameplay. Yeah, we, we follow Presidente on this lonely, lonely road. It's lonely at the top, ladies and gentlemen. It's very lonely. All right, let's get in today's episodes. Now, we got a few tests that we got to do. The customs office from the religious community, which I don't know how to how that affects them or why they care about that but hey they wanted it okay access trade route which we're working on build residential buildings two of them okay cool healthcare happiness i don't know how much we're going to do that and produce some meat. so we're going to be working on that today as well as looking at a few other things other buildings maybe start finally start the cigar industry i'm not sure because i'm not really so oh, as just as i say that i see let me see here let me see here. Yeah, still no cigar, but there's tobacco. I mean, we, we can we can talk about that too, but not really the best price. Either way, regardless, that's what we are going to be doing today. Let's take a look at our signed contracts. Rum, 800, still out of 16,000, 16, so we still got a way to go. Uh, let's go here. The meat is almost done. We took the meat because really there wasn't any other good deals. It was it was a smaller portion, whatever. We will try to build embassies today as well. That's one of the things that I kind of want to focus on. Okay, without further ado, let's let's just keep it going. Uh, customs office. Once again, I'm just mind baffled to why do you guys want a customs office? I really don't know why. I don't know how much is it for. Forty five hundred for the blueprint, and nine thousand for the man. That's a lot of money, but it does ex does increase export prices it does increase export prices hmm huh 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 man man oh man okay that's gonna be tricky i mean because oh one trade route is done which one was that the banana so we're done with that already okay so that should be happy so we got one open let's see we were just here planks sugar we are exporting sugar if we do 2800 units uh, we'll do that just as a side, even though, like I said in the last episode, if, if, uh, what should we get from them? We'll take the money right now because we're running low on money. If you are, if you don't see a trade deal that you're not crazy about, you don't feel pressure to take it. You can just put it on the side, wait for another one, you know? Do not feel pressure to take it. How is high school doing? School's doing good. Filled up as usual. How many graduates? Zero so far, but we did just build it kind of towards the end of last episode. Uh, one thing I did want to see real quick is uh the faction standing the politics of tropical so capitalist 44 percent approval rating about i would say 44 which is not good communists love us and they're the majority when it comes to militarists or the religious community militarists love us more than the majority we're not really far behind um we're not really far behind the religious community opposition is one percent and decide is 15 and support is 84 percent with 270 eligible voters we don't have any rebel threat right now i wouldn't think so i uh, think there's offices la 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 okay so i just want to take a look at that and if you don't remember we are really low on unemployment which is good and bad it's good that people have jobs bad that well we can't really plop anything till we get more more folks in but Let's go ahead and build a couple of more bunk houses, because this seems to be the things that they want. First of all, how's this apartment? This apartment's not even filled up all the way. That's why I didn't. I was almost was gonna build two of them, and I'm glad I didn't. Boy, am I glad I didn't. Let me go ahead and cancel construction. I don't know for some reason I like them. I like them just separated a little bit. Put one here. We'll put one kind of diversify this area maybe. Oh yeah, we'll put one here. Why not? Since we don't really have any housing going on this area. And we'll, let's go ahead and build a country house here, too. Build a country house here. And can we fit one here? Oh, yeah, we can fit one here. We'll build two country houses. So that should help out a little bit. 22 out of 27, 981 days left for this. I don't know, man. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what to tell you guys. I mean, it's a stupid one. Don't forget that we can relocate the palace for 2,500. And maybe eventually we'll relocate it here, maybe. Relocate it on its own island. I don't know, but we will do that. Uh, so, but let's go ahead and finally get it out of the way, man. You only live once, right? We're gonna go ahead and unlock the embassy. And we are going to unlock or build one so far. We might build two. They're not really the cheapest. They're not really the most expensive either. So, you know, either or. 
either or another thing but the problem is we don't have that high of unemployment i didn't want to build a couple more ranches just to make sure that we have enough food going on we got banana meats 10 out of 150 so as you can see here that's that's very nice man i love how they did things in this tropical six is more detailed if you're all about the analytics in this game the statistics you're gonna like how it goes you are going to like how it goes so this is going on right now okay cool what upgrades do we have here let's take a look decreases sugar consumption by 25 percent uh five thousand or we could just build a five thousand get another embassy right now we can build it here no more coconut trees where at all of these oh no which ones are you guys talking about? Oh, this one right here. Oh, at least it does have it. Okay, well. Oh, well. Go ahead and demolish it. We'll go ahead and demolish it. If there's no more coconut, then there's no more coconut, you know? There's no more coconut, then there's no more coconut. Not much we can do about that, but they do have some cheap upgrades that I don't mind give doing. Go ahead and do this as well. $300 increases job quality by five. Increases efficiency just for 300 I wish I would have found out about this earlier that would have been nice that's a very nice efficient upgrade all right cool that's done um last episode i said i wasn't gonna build two oh we got another protest why is the military the only people protesting let's see a president people are, are angry not at you of course about what we have become what do you want prom promise to hear raise health care by what bribe the protesters five there's only one person protesting bribe them for five hundred dollars or just send the military to really get him but what what did it want promise to raise healthcare happiness okay that's we already have that i guess they're kind of blue balling me right now or hard balling i guess is the word i got no choice but to accept that and then we're gonna do that i can believe the bunk houses are built yes they are filled up nice that's what i like to see there was one here filled up also nice the two country houses no no so that's a big that's a big disappointment right there but hey you know it's very important that you take a look at all this stuff and you remember where you put things because you need to know how they're doing you don't want to just plop things and not know exactly what the hell is going on with, with, with your island you know we will go ahead and build build an uh, a restaurant here for for them seems like a nice place to run build a restaurant actually maybe you can put it here because there's more houses here it doesn't matter really actually let's put it by the high school you know, as I always say, we will rearrange the island later on. But at first, you know, if, if we if we have if we have an option to kind of lay it out how we want to, why not? You know, and we have an option right now. Over here, we can probably do. We got more people that are unemployed. Okay, thirteen. Uh, okay, perfect. We can go ahead and maybe get a ranch going in this area if it fits where the coconut harvest was, because we do need some meat. Does it fit? It does fit. Perfect. Meat. Let's go ahead and get a cattle. Pigs get the meat. Cattle. Now we're going to go with the goats. We'll go with pigs because it's, it's the most green one that we saw. Go ahead and get that going. Is the NBC open? Yes, it is. So we need to, we're need. we going to invite the... Oh, boy. Who do we invite? We're going to invite the allies. And we're going to praise them. We will build an embassy for the access eventually. Uh, probably before before we progress to the next world war we will do it eventually just just not right now just got a notification that we do have low rebel threat even though we bribed them even though we've been really giving them what they want what is this have a cabaret near the embassy nah dude nah there wasn't i don't know if it was a bug or it was part of a, a, an ongoing bug or it's because it was a beta but there was a thing that i've noticed when i played the beta that after a while, once again, entertainment buildings just lose, people stop going to them. Like, even if you didn't have anything, even if the beautification was good, people just stop going to them. So there was that, oh, here comes, here comes the immigrants. Damn, this is, this is a, this a lot of them, dude. I didn't think it was going to be that much. Oh, boy. 23 immigrants right now on the island. And just new immigrants that just popped in. 23 of them. Okay, politics, let's see. Access like us. We actually have an embassy, but access like us more than the allies, even though the allies are in our, at our embassy. You know what? Just for that, oh, I think they don't like us as much anymore because we said, no, we're not going to give you a cabaret near your embassy. I think that's why. But we'll go ahead and build an embassy here as well. Give give access their own embassy too. Are these country houses still not filled up? Okay, that's alarming. Come on. 
Come on, better than Shaq or Little Eden. Increases the upkeep, blah, blah, blah. But we got to go ahead and get that, just get it filled up, even though it increases the upkeep. But we're, we're trying to fill it up. We are trying to fill it up. Gonna go ahead. We got to send them on a treasure hunt, a hunt. Since we do got something. Of course, you can select more than once, more than one at once. You can always do that. So we'll go ahead and do that. And we'll get like this next. Whatever. That, that, that works out. That works out for us. Okay, let's take a look at the trade deal. See what cigars are still not in our vicinity, are they? They're not really here, are they? No, not yet, unfortunately. That sucks. I don't know why cigars are not, like, popular. They usually are. Usually are. Maybe around the world, world uh, Cold War, that's, that's when they become more popular. But right now, they're definitely not popular at all. Iron. Pirates want iron. We have a lot of iron, but it's... For the price, it's not worth uh, the, the relations that, that we're going to drop. We actually might hit it. 26 out of 27. And we got about two years left. A little less than two years for this to happen. So we actually might hit this promise. That should make him happy. Next up is the customs office. I guess this is shaping up to be like the gov government area, if you will. Hold on. I just want to make sure. It's always good to just kind of see. Can we build a street this way? Absolutely not. I guess we're going to have to go from here. Okay, so... We can definitely make use of this area. Kind of go like this over here. And build on this side and this side as well. So we're going to go ahead and get the customs office rolling here. Uh, since it has been requested. And yeah, we do have... Uh, even though spendy, but... You know, it does help us raise the import prices. So you won't hear me complain too much about that. Go ahead and put that here. And let's go ahead and invite the access as well. We'll praise them. I think the nice thing about it is you can... Oh, look at that. We can ask for financial aid, but it does... I think it drops down the, the, the nationalist standings. So we're not going to ask for that just yet because we're not really... Uh, we could actually. We, we could ask for it. Let's take a look. Let's, let's experiment together, okay? Uh, politics. Okay, we're about 72% support. Not really much here is going on. So let's see if we ask for financial aid. Requires relationship 7 1. Okay, let's see. How much did we get? Did we get anything? As for financial aid, didn't, didn't tell me exactly how much, but should tell us pretty soon. But either way, let's, let's take a look. Did, did it drop down anything at all for us? Politics, still 72. Looks about the same to me. I don't know. Looks about the same. Uh, but let's superpowers. Should tell us here at least where the financial aid is. No, it's not telling us. I think if we click on the embassy itself, it should tell us how much money they gave us. No, they're still not telling us. Okay, well, whatever. I think you could ask financial aid from both of them. Oh, it does drop down their relationship with you. That's what it does. So maybe not the smartest move, but whatever. We we, we got we got about twenty thousand from each of them. So hey, <laughs> they paid they paid for the embassies, dude. You know, they paid for both of the embassies. But the allies' relationship is 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 way lower than I would like. I remember when. Political difficulties high. You gotta be careful. Now we do we take the five thousand or do we take the religious standing? Cause we can use the five thousand, but we can also use the religious standing because we need everybody in our side. We'll take the religious standing right now, plus five. That went up literally took us from seventy percent support to seventy two percent. So maybe it was worth it after all. And we do have some money that we can unlock the church. Twenty three hundred to unlock it, the blueprint, and about forty six hundred to build it. But you know. We, 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 we can we can go ahead and do that. We'll put it right... Mm, we'll put it right here. Seems to be like the residential area that's shaping up to be the residential area. So that's how it kind of go. Like over here is shaping up to be eventually when these go away. Oh, nice. 1,000 Swiss bank account. When these go away, eventually this will be like the governmental area. Government area, if you will. Residential area. So, you know, shaping up, shaping, shaping this up itself. So we're, we're hit 27 out of 27. I don't know if this will go away or not. But uh, I don't know when it's going to trigger that we, we we got it. But it's pretty cool stuff. We can praise? No, not yet. Okay, let's keep it going. We do have a deal for for uh, for, for leather and we, we are exporting it as it is. So why not take it? That's the question. Why not take it? Tobacco, sugar again. Um, maybe we'll go with the sugar because our standings with the allies is a little low. 
So it could be kind of like a two in one, hit two birds with one stone type of deal. Five thousand for a new trade license. That's where they start getting really expensive. And we'll go ahead and take the we'll take the sugar deal. We'll take twenty eight hundred units. Yeah, we'll take the sugar deal just to kind of make him be a little more happy with us. Because then I like the fact that we asked for financial aid, I guess. But we'll take that. We will take that. We got ten thousand dollars in coming revenue. And what about here? About two thousand. Okay, cool, cool stuff, man. We should build a street connecting this with this. This way, Teamsters could come, uh, could have an easier way to connect between these two, these two dogs. Dogs, <laughs> I said dogs. Here we go. Let's do it like this. There we are. Nice, sweet. I want you guys to take a look at this. Look at the fort upgrades. Now we got to take a look at the barracks and the fort. But look at all the upgrades you get. Modernized weapons increases the fire rate by ten percent. Decreases upkeep by five. The risk of catching fire is reduced. Increases effectiveness. Blah blah blah. I mean, look look at all these upgrades that you can get. I'm not gonna go one by one. You guys could pause the video and take a look at them if you'd like. Let's take a look at the barracks. Modernized weapons, which we we'll, which we will get for this. Uh, so it's it's pretty nice, pretty nice stuff that is going on. Okay, the the the, the challenges has been accepted. Or not the challenge. The the, the healthcare. I'm gonna have a barrack near Embassy of Axe. We already have one, dude. Right here. We accepted it anyways. We'll just build one around here eventually. But they want us to pick an alliance. Do we go for... I feel like the allies are being a little... Snotty. You know? I feel like the Axis is being more understanding of what's going on. And the alliance is being a little snotty. So we might go for the Axis, honestly. We might go for the Axis. How's this restaurant doing good filled up? And this church is not even built and people are already in. Is it not built? Why is this still around it? What? What's going on there? But anyways, it's built up. So that, that should make people happier as far as religious. The religious needs faith. Dang, man. Faith is so hard to get up sometimes. Health is up. Food is up. Liberty or uh, let's see. Housing. It's about the same. About the same, but... I mean, I don't, I don't understand this when it comes to housing because, okay, this has been like this for a while. So we're going to go ahead and also put a little Eden um, mold on here to kind of fill it up. Uh, wouldn't hurt to kind of get another bunkhouse here as well. Let's get another bunkhouse going on. It's not going to hurt us. There it is. Nice. Very, very nice. As you can see, we're, we're, we're moving. We're, we're kind of doing the things that we're doing. Um, we got the customs office, the embassy, so governmental... Or, or, or political uh, steps have been taken this episode is going to help us. Uh, we checked in the food. Everything is good. We got the church going. Barracks going. So we're, we're going to be focusing on finally, we got enough citizens. We're finally going to focus on expanding another industry next episode. That's what we're going to do. I hope you guys did enjoy this episode. If you did, please hit the like button. Appreciate all the support and love you guys have been giving me the last three episodes. It's been amazing, man. Thank you guys very, very much. But yeah, and if you're new to the channel, make sure you do join the J Army. And uh, we'll, we'll keep this going for you guys. We'll take a look at some some edicts. Edict. That's, who, that's what it is. Edict. I had, a, I had the worst time saying that for a while. But we'll take a look at that. So with that being said, ladies and gentlemen, my name is Jerry Tastic, and I am out.